Sometimes history intersects with current cultural trends and issues. And so for today, I thought I'd talk about there's a, a movement afoot to redesign the state seal. And um, this is the state seal on our state flag. So there's people that want to redesign the state um, symbol and the state flag ultimately. And But I thought just in case you, we do redesign, then it would be too late to know what some of the symbolism is in our flag. So let's talk about a couple things in the flag. Um, there's three dates on our state flag. One is 1819, that's the establishment of Fort Snelling. 1858 on the top is the uh, statehood day, which is May 11th, um, 1858, when we became a state. And 1893 is when we adopted the flag. And then you'll notice some of the other issues in here are um, open to interpretation. But it's, it's, it's messy. It's not um, clean, so to speak. And so there's a movement, as I said, to redesign the flag because of how offensive some people perceive the symbolism in the flag and our nation, our state seal. And what's interesting, that, um, this is a bit interesting um, little bit of tid tidbit, um, there's 19 stars. And if I left you alone to your own devices to figure out what those 19 stars are, you would never guess that. It's 19 stars is we were the 19th state to become a state after the original 13 because we were the 32nd state. So that's why there's 19 stars. If you ever figure out why there's 66 yellow dots on the state flag, I'm all ears. Because every time I go to the historical society and ask them why are there 66 yellow dots on our, on our flag, they kind of shrug their shoulders and they go, there's really no reason for that. Well, anyways, there's a quick little tutorial. Let, um, I'm in full on favor of redesigning our state flag because um, it'd be a good lesson for um, our young people to come up with a design. Thanks for listening.